taller than mom. Baron Trump towers over Melania, aged just 11, as the pair greet the official White House Christmas tree. Baron Trump stepped out alongside his mother, First Lady Melania Trump, at the White House Monday afternoon as she greeted the official White House Christmas tree. The 11-year-old President Trump's youngest son hasn't been spotted much since moving to Washington, though President Obama and First Lady Michelle Obama often enlisted the help of daughters Sasha and Malia around the holidays. Most famously, the two Obama daughters often stood alongside their father as he pardoned a turkey every Thanksgiving week. Baron Trump may be put in the same position, as the turkeys have arrived in Washington and a lucky one will be pardoned by President Trump tomorrow, the first time the Republican has participated in the event. Today's appearance by the two Trumps was short and sweet. First, a horse-drawn carriage pulled up this year's tree, which will eventually be situated in the Blue Room. The White House's giant Christmas trees almost always fill the entire room. This year's tree was provided by the Chapman family of Silent Night Evergreens, located in Endeavor, Wisconsin. They were the winners of the National Christmas Tree Association National Tree Contest. The winners of the contest have provided the official White House Christmas tree since 1966, the White House said. Melania Trump stepped onto the North Portico, sporting slacks, heeled boots, a red turtleneck sweater and had a plaid trench coat draped over her shoulders, a style the First Lady loves to wear. A dressed-up Baron was wearing a white button-down shirt and a jacket and slacks, with boots. The two Trumps greeted the horse-drawn carriage and spent about a minute surveying the tree before going to meet and take pictures with the Chapman family. The tree greeting ceremony marks the official start of the holiday season at the White House, which will continue tomorrow with President Trump's first turkey pardoning. The two turkeys arrived in Washington, D. C. Sunday night and are staying at the Willard Hotel, a luxury space a block down Pennsylvania Avenue from the White House. Today, their names chosen by the White House were announced. Drumstick and Wishbone. Trump will pardon one of the turkeys in the Rose Garden, with the White House leaving the decision of which bird up to a Twitter poll.